I spoke to you multiple times about excuses. And there's an excuse which crops up a lot. Especially when it comes to guys wanting to improve their health. Maybe it was me with my sales call, shall we say, as much as I hate the word sales, because it's a choice you have. You can either be healthy or you're not. You're either accountable or you're not. You're either optimized or you're not. Productive or you're not. It is a choice. I do not have to sell that to you. This excuse is not that I haven't got time, I haven't got money, any of that stuff. This excuse boils down to communication. And that was, I hate that because my wife likes it. I hate that because my wife told me to. I hate that donut because my wife wanted me to. Maybe not in those exact words, or I can't eat that because my wife doesn't want me to. She moans when I do this, she moans when I do that. My wife doesn't want me to work out. Really? My wife doesn't want me to eat healthy. Really? This boils down to communication. And unfortunately, this is one of the big reasons, and I'm saying this as a man, this is potentially gonna work the other shoe on the other foot. If you're a lady and your husband, if you're in the same sex relationship, your other half, it boils down to communication of what you, you as an individual want to do with your life, want to do with your health, your productivity, your business, your focus, your energy. It's nobody else's energy. It is nobody else's life. It is your life, your communication and your choice. Because what you put into your body is essentially down to you. If you physically don't like onions, mushrooms, tomatoes or tomatoes, whichever side of the pond you're from, that is your choice to eat it. If an egg is something you're allergic to, you're not going to eat it. If you don't like rice, you don't like broccoli, you don't like meat, you, you don't like meat? That's a story for another day. You don't like beef, you don't like chicken, you don't like fish, you don't like tofu. If you physically do not like something to the point where you put it in your mouth and you gag, you are not going to eat it. And no doubt you would have told your wife that. You would have told your husband that, your other half. And they're not going to force you to eat it. If it gives you an allergic reaction, they're not going to force you to eat it. Unless they're a complete bastard for it. But when it comes down to eating junk food, I hear this excuse over and over again. I went out with my wife and I had to eat it because she wanted to eat it. No, that is simply an excuse. Whether you like it or not, it is an excuse. It is a choice that you are making to eat that food. You can go out and have a date. You can go out and have ice cream, believe it or not. Even if your wife isn't having dessert, you can go out and have ice cream, but remember, Tell your wife this. Look, honey, I'm going to order ice cream. Do you want some ice cream? Because if you do, that is cool. But do not wait for my ice cream to come and have one spoonful. That is not cool. It is not a sharing portion. Ice cream is not here to be shared. There's one spoon for a reason. It's my portion. Now, do you want ice cream? Do you want fries? Don't eat my fries, do you want fries? Cool, that is cool, okay? Communication, you see where we got with that? Now communication comes when you say, no, I don't want fries, I don't want that donut, I don't want ice cream. Stick to your guns. Remember why you wanna change your health, why you wanna improve, why you wanna optimize, why you wanna have better energy, more vitality, more focus, why you wanna be able to walk past that mirror and rip your shirt off and say, yes, boss, I am feeling great. Remember that. 
And remember, it's your choice. Your choice if you want to eat crap. Your choice if you want to feel crap. And if you just want to explain to your husband, your wife, your better half, that look, I don't want that donut, I don't want that ice cream, I don't want to eat all that chocolate. Because afterwards I feel bad. Afterwards I feel bad because it makes me feel bad. It's taking me away from my goals. It's not to say you can't have chocolate. It's taking me away from my goals. If I take myself away from my goals, I am going to feel bad about it. It's going to make my mood get low. Potentially, that will make me feel low and I will take it out on you. Which is not what I want to do because I love you. I'm eating this way because I want to drop this fat. I want to feel better. I want to make us more money. I want to have more confidence. That is why I'm eating this way. So please, please let me eat this way. And I have no harm, no issue with you having a donut. Remember guys, in those famous words of Arnold Schwarzenegger, put the cookie down! I'll speak to you soon.